Hi guys, and welcome to uh, another chapter from my book, Graceful Thoughts. This is trying to get it in picture shot. I still have a few copies of this book available if anybody's still interested, priced at £7 plus £2 postage and packing in the UK. And for those abroad, if you're interested, it's available as a Kindle download for £4.50. Coming to the end of the chapters in in the book that I've wrote now for where I'm recording and reading them out loud and I shall be looking at uh, introducing more content as it comes out of my eclectic head so stay tuned for that. This is called Banished Doubt and was written in approximately 2018 somewhere around that, that marker now. My aspiration is gained from peers, those who by my perception are more learned or wiser than myself those who offer light and guidance in sometimes seemingly dark places. They are sturdy when others may stumble. I've enjoyed some inspirational moments recently. For example, when those close to me talk in positive and uplifting ways about my mediumistic gift and communication skills and the positive effect my guidance has had on their lives. Life is beginning to make sense. The trials and tribulations of the past are becoming a diminished memory. I now accept the past as the past. The past has shaped, has shaped me, but it does not define me. I find that people seek my advice and desire to hear my talks and presentations wherever I go. The feedback is 99% positive. The remaining 1% suggest I waffle or talk too much. Of course, they are right. This is who I am. Messages are my purpose, future and happiness. The 99% verdict is I am doing something worthwhile which will benefit my friends and clients. I'm a happy and fortunate man. The same as all humankind, I have been through uh, turbulent periods. Because of my experiences, I feel able to give a few pointers to finding happiness and security. The secret I share with you is this. I listen to myself more often, work hard, and accept that I am worthy of success. I ask you, dear readers, to admit you may have the same doubts as I once harboured. Free yourself from negative thoughts and change your life. You are what you think. We know this, but understand what your thoughts and beliefs do to your existence. Your thoughts are going out into the universe, so make them confident, powerful and enriching, even in the low and despondent moments of your life. Decide never to give up and accept darkness is temporary. I look forward to the time when you'll enjoy your successes and learn from less pleasant experiences. It's interesting to note that there are no, no failures, only life lessons. Self-worth, self-respect, self-confidence all start with the self. And all you seek begins from within. Love yourself to the same degree that you love and care for the people that are central to your life. Determine your experience with the same passion as your love for your environment, hobbies, possessions. Treat yourself with self-respect and face your demons without fear. Look at who you are with honesty and without any doubts. Focus on what you can do and not the things which are worthless or waste in a lifetime. Set realistic goals and achieve them step by step. And yes, we do sometimes stumble. So what? Going forward in time is the positive direction to be heading. Progression is the word to fix in your mind. A significant problem for many people seems to be dreaming of a life away. The I will be better when I have the possession or it will be better when my dream comes true. The realities of experience become the records of our lives. These records are made from the choices made in the present moment. The now, whenever you find yourself needing to get a future, take a pause and notice the now. And when a situation seems to stagnate, remember, the only difference between here and there is tea. So have a cup of tea. As you drink it, take time to appreciate what you have today. Your family, friends, today's efforts and toils, the difficulties you are learning from and the mistakes that you will not make again. There is always something to be thankful for and accept as part of one of life's lessons. During the last 18 months of my life, I've enjoyed and learned from the many readings I've given. I've spoke thousands of words guiding my clients to see different aspects of their life. A significant percentage of my clients ask for direction. The direction is found in the choices made with the options available. Remember, wishing for change is not an option. 
The answers to issues are often discovered by trusting yourself and personal preferences. Following the idea of A and other may not work if the ideas are opposing to your inner self. Remember, life is for living and enjoying. It should not be just an existence. An individual's life will not progress and evolve without the self's or inner being's cooperation. So, trust your feelings, trust your intuition and trust your abilities. Do not reflect upon or envy the skills of A and other. Focus on your expertise. Everything from baking a cake to keeping a home calm and happy calls for knowledge. Knowledge has to be learned and learning to do something well takes time. Our attitude is an essential part of being successful. Consider a man can find friends when he smiles, cares and interacts. No one can find new friends by being unhappy and miserable. It is difficult to make changes and take a chance where we are without support. The changes in my life are working because people see my happiness even though I'm taking chances. They support me and help me during these changes. If I were unhappy and miserable, how could they support me when I do something that makes me unhappy? Unhappiness signifies deep-rooted problems and rather than looking for them, take a chance. Look to the future. Work for happiness and success today and magic will happen. Unfortunately, success can be evasive to humans who see the dark side or the dangers of taking a chance. Are they or will they be successful? I doubt it and I trust that I am right. Banish doubt. Follow your inner being. Trust your choices. Choose to be happy and life will change. When there is a problem that seemingly cannot be solved, make a change. Take a chance and ask yourself what is there to lose. Whenever something doesn't work out, accept the outcome without reflection. Surely, it's better to attempt to change or do something differently rather than be fixed in a problematic or nightmare situation. And if something does not work out, remember, if our choice is made with the right kind of moral intentions, there is nothing wrong with the making or taking a chance. Consider the only debt that people owe is to themselves. Therefore, it is essential to be the best version of yourself that you can be during each moment of your life. I pray that everybody should find peace and happiness, security and wealth. Remember, prayer and constructive inner thought is a powerful and real energy transfer. I desire the best for everybody and I, and I want and I expect the best for myself. I know opportunities are out there for you to embrace, so take a chance. Trust your inner being. Go out and manifest your dreams through affirmative action. Thinking made man bright and actions made the ideas became a reality. WWE wrestling is one of my interests and there is a tagline associated with the sport. It says, are you ready? I remind everyone that life is for living. So when there is doubt or a change to be made, ask this question. Ask yourself in the loudest of voices, are you ready? If the inner being says yes, then do not let yourself down. Trust yourself and take action. Take a chance and see where the changes take you. And if there is still a doubt, I remind you all, humans are awesome and uniquely talented individuals. They, they only have to trust this universal truth. Know the wisdom of another truth, a fantastic life, starts outside of your comfort zone. My desire is that you have enjoyed my thoughts and I welcome comments. I consider all people as friends and so should you. Life is better when we work together. Lovely words um, and it even makes me smile even though we're four or five years on down the line. And I hope that you can take something from those words that I wrote years ago. Thank you once again for tuning in. I really appreciate all, this, all of the support. Recommend me. Um, like and subscribe to my channel it is all very much appreciated thank you once again for tuning in hopefully see you on the next one thank you